let's begin. Wait, are we live right now? <laughs> yeah, we're live. Sorry about the delay, everyone. Uh, blame the other egos. They're busy doing something right now, but I'm here. So let's begin. All right, uh, let me get on the scan. First, we're gonna. I'll be answering the questions that you guys sent in. There's two types of questions that we'll be answering. First is the, the CPO questions, and then afterwards we'll be answering like personal non-CPO questions. And um, but we'll do that later once the egots are here. Sorry, wait. Is is Adam gonna come online? Yeah, he's coming soon. The first question is, can you give us a hint on what will come in November? Um, I can't really say because that would like ruin the surprise. But all I can say is that there's a custom party similar to the end game party that we had in May. But I think this one is gonna be much better. So you guys will be enjoying that. And we also have a mini event planned for uh, November as well. It's, it's one of those week long events, but this one's going to be better because you guys can participate in it as well. But we'll get more into that once, uh, once Halloween party is over. And yeah. That's pretty much it for November. We might do something else. We might not. Um, the ideas that I uh, put out, we might add them in November as well when we have time. But as you can tell, we are doing lots of stuff already, so it depends. Uh, second question, what's your favorite part of being an admin on uh, CPO? Jacob, do you want to answer this first? Yeah, so I'll answer this. My favorite part is catching rule breakers. I got to feel out of it. <laughs> yeah, catching rule breakers. Uh, anything else? Um, catching rule breakers, uh, you know... I don't know, hanging out with uh, Adam and Jacko, it's the best part. Yeah. Uh, well, oh, I mean, and also the community. Uh, yeah, the community, can't forget that. Yeah. Uh, for me, the best part about being admin is... <sighs> I don't know really, I just like, I'm good at... Uh leading like planning stuff uh new updates and all that stuff organizing the team uh thinking about new ideas all of that stuff i like uh leading that's what i like good answer uh third question this is a popular question that everyone has been asking. So I'm going to be answering this like fully that so everyone would like help asking. And I think everyone already knows what I'm going to say. But third question, when does Kajitsu Snow come out? So as you all know, Huey is the best uh, companion private server developer. Like we have Kojitsu Fire, Kojitsu Water, normal Kojitsu. Like that's all fine. But with Kojitsu Water uh, Snow, that 
really difficult. Like the way Disney made it, it's not the same as a uh, fire or water. So it takes like a lot to make a fully functional project, you know. And to be completely honest with you guys, um, we aren't really sure when it'll be completed. Like, if it was a medium, like, not that hard to do, then it would have released, like, already. Because we really do care about making CPO fully functional, having everything, all of that. But Kajitsu Snow is, like, really, really difficult to do. So we don't know when it'll be done, or maybe even if it will be, like, completed. So... And even if we do complete it, um, it will probably be like a bit too late because of uh, Flash dying and we'll be moving to like HD ML5. So I know it's probably not the answer that you guys wanted, but it's the truth. So sorry about that. Yeah. Um... Just going to insert myself here. I'd like to welcome Adam Blaze to the party. Just showing up. He was the one making a lot of noise. Yeah. So, yeah. Hi. <laughs> Sorry for the noise. I didn't realize we were alive yet. Yeah, and we are still alive, so don't make any more oh. noise. <laughs> I'll be quiet. <laughs> uh, fourth question. What has been your favorite party? throughout CPO. So I think this is asking like what's your what's our most favorite party that happened on CPO? And I don't think you guys can answer because you guys want like I think Adam should answer first. <laughs> what's your favorite party? We're too new. We're too new to answer. Yeah. Um, yeah, I would say uh, I would say that mine is the four million party. Uh I thought it was very exciting. And yeah. yeah, probably the best party that I've ever been to on CPO. Yeah, um, for me, it's the end game party. That's the my favorite CPO party. Um, it was the most popular party that we had this year. Like over four hundred thousand users uh, participated throughout the party. So that's saying something. But I think the party that's coming out in November will top it for sure. So just be ready for that. Oh, and then now we also have Jacko who just tried to play as well. Jacko, hi. Hey. Oh, uh, we're we're actually asking a question. Uh, what what was your favorite CPO party? My favorite CPO party would have to be the uh, 4 million party. That's a good answer. I like that one too. <laughs> yeah. No, I couldn't even the answer. The same party it. that Jacob likes. Yeah. It's just because it's crazy how question. good this game has gotten. So. Yeah, it's also true. The third question is, uh, do you ever go on spare accounts so no one knows uh, who you are? Yo, I I'll answer this one. Yeah, yeah. sometimes I go on spare accounts just to try. Like, you know when there's a moderator in the room, everyone kind of behaves? Yeah. Um, I go on alt accounts just because usually people break the rules a bit more often when you're not there. So yeah. I just... Do you ever break the rules on an alt account? No, well, no, no. I don't. I don't really speak on an alt. I just kind of just make sure everything's safe, you know, in the rooms that no one's <laughs> looking at. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> yeah, good answer. <laughs> I never break the rules. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I always go in that alt account. I have lots of alt accounts. So. Yeah. I think everyone does that. Like even on other servers. Like it's not really a thing like on CPO. <laughs> Uh, okay, this is a good one. Number six. Did you ever expect to make such a successful recreation of uh, Club Penguin? And to be honest, 
No. Because when we made uh, CPO, me and Huey, uh, CP rewritten was the number one server. And they had like over 1 million users. So we never thought we'd like overtake them. We thought that they would always be like number one. We would just be like some small server, with, like a small community. So the fact that we overtook them in less than a year and well, well we just passed for uh, 4 million registered users, that's uh, incredible. And we're thankful for our success and the community that we made along the way. So thank you. All right. Uh, All right. What's the next question? Another question? Yeah, we got another question here. Yeah. Um, okay, this is another one, but it's directed at me. Uh, Riley, how did you get the idea to start CPO? So again, this is like the beginning of twenty eighteen. No, the December twenty seventeen. Me and Huey wanted to make a copying private server similar to CPU rewritten but we wanted to use a newer client and we noticed that there was no other server that had like a new client so I came up with the name copying online Timmy developed it and then we released it lots of people liked it and here we are today Pretty nice how uh, like players can pick the old client or the new client now. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes just that... figure out that was... yeah, yeah, sometimes I play in the old client. Just it's a bit more nostalgic for me because I was I played Capone years yeah. ago. Yeah, All same. That. Okay, now the next questions are gonna be like general questions like uh non-cpo questions so like about our lives and uh, stuff like that and i'll be right. letting you guys answer first that's all right. right all right uh where are you guys from um well, I'm from Ireland. <laughs> you could, and everyone could probably guess from the accent, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and I'm from Canada, so. Yeah, yeah. I'm also from Canada. And nice. I'm from the United Kingdom. Alright, uh, next question, man. Uh, what's your favorite song? Um. Plug Walk by Rich the Kid. That's my favorite song. Um, yeah. I would have to say Bitcoin Bandit. <laughs> uh, that's that's actually a very good song. Um, by Atlas. If you've never heard it, search it up. Yeah, it's just a song I like to uh, vibe to when I'm bored. I don't know. I don't really have a favorite song. Probably just like mostly old Travis Scott stuff. Yeah. My favorite song is uh, Mud on My Mind. You guys I knew you were going to say that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You knew she was with this song. <laughs> and next question. Let's see. Okay. This is kind of related to CPO, but like. It's for you guys. Uh, as an e chord what do you guys uh, do to keep CPO running? Um, well, we provide funding sometimes. Uh, we, um, we're uh, well, actually, good. actually one of the big parts of our job is actually inventory management. <laughs> so, yes. Yeah. 
yeah and, um, and some of us like like myself we like we can do programming so if there's any like yeah. just if there's small odd jobs that Huey can get to um we have yeah, that so I, just because you talked about me dev, so Adam just helps around sometimes her yeah. <laughs> one month talked about me I was actually a designer for CPO for a short time so I made a couple buttons on the home page and that was it that was probably my biggest contribution to CPO, honestly. Uh, mostly just see God's ban people. You know, couch rule breakers, couch cheaters. Um, I'm helping Ralia with a little bit of getting some promotion for CPO. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Mm. Okay, this is another question for you guys. Um, what's the best thing about being an equal? <laughs> Um, I, I, well, I like being a part of the community, if you know what I mean, like, it's, it's an honor, if you, you could put it that way, right. to kind of be able to be a part of a community that's so huge, and it's something I wanted to do ever since I was a kid. Long. Like the cheaters and people who acted appropriately. The best part about being an e-god is, uh, yeah, finding cheaters. That's a thrill. Yeah, Jacob um just likes to get on and ban cheaters. That's he just gets his uh, ban fixed for the day and logs off. <laughs> yeah, fifty people there. I don't yeah. compromise. <laughs> okay, so never break any rules. Um, are you in school? And if so, what are you studying? Um. I'm in college at the moment and doing computer science. So I'm 20 years old, so I'm a bit too old for school. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm in university and I am studying uh, gender studies. Nice. Jacko, what are you doing? Right, I have a bachelor's in uh, sim swapping. <laughs> That's now. impressive. Um, <laughs> right now, I'm not actually doing anything, so, yeah. Okay, next question is, what's your biggest fear? Um, <laughs> spiders, I really don't like spiders. Sounds kind of stupid, but... <laughs> you have a lot of spiders in your house, though. Yeah, I know, I know, you, should, you guys should see my house, there's like spiders everywhere. <laughs> really? <laughs> Yeah, I, yeah, I killed uh, him half an hour ago. <laughs> my biggest fear is uh, Bitcoin. Well, actually going on to uh, look at the Bitcoin price and seeing that's at like zero or something. I'd probably cry. Yeah, um, I would say my biggest fear would have to be React or Homeland. <laughs> Good answer. Yeah. Good answer. <laughs> my, my biggest fear... Wait, Adam, what do you think my biggest fear is? <laughs> everything. Absolutely everything. <laughs> You're super paranoid. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. are, you are. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that, that answers it. <laughs> Riley was actually diagnosed uh, by uh, psychotic. He actually has schizophrenia, if anyone didn't know. <laughs> yeah, thank Very you for sure. that <laughs> Uh, next one is, are you an only child, or do you have any uh, siblings? Yeah, I'm an only child. Um, I, I like it better that way, because there's no one annoying me. <laughs> I, you know, in my free time, I don't have to kind of care about anything. Just sit down and do my, do my thing. Yeah. Um, I have a brother. So. Do you actually? I didn't know you had a brother. Yeah, yeah. I, I have one. I have one too. Uh, that's I actually how I was late. I was uh, picking up from the translation. Wait, wait, wait. Are they older or younger? Um, He's older than me. Oh, I didn't even know that. Yeah, I did not know that either. <laughs> it's all uh, coming out now. I have, yeah. I have uh, seven sisters and five Dad. brothers. Wow, that's a big family. Yeah. yeah. We're... 
Indian, so like we have lots of, you know, family members. Yeah. Right. Uh, next question. Well, there isn't any other questions I can tell. How about you answer some questions from the chat? Oh wait, there's new ones. Let. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to talk to see them? Um, there's a question about, uh, to Jacko about his, uh, his favorite YouTuber. I don't know if he wants to talk about that. My favorite YouTuber would have to be Tamago2474. <laughs> nah, but ask, they're asking about that, like, they want, uh, your side of the story. Like we oh, should actually okay. talk about that. Uh, like, uh, right. so, so, so. <laughs> that's, that's a good question. Yeah, yeah I, like, let's, talk, let's talk about uh, what's his name? Tamago 472474. Yeah, let's talk about him. So right. this was, I mean, this was wait, 100%. Wait, okay. Can I can I explain? Can I get the yeah, yeah, like for a second? Yeah, yeah. Talk, All right, talk, so talk. firstly, yeah. this is 100% Jaco's doing. <laughs> What the? No, 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 no. It, was, it was Adam Blaze. No, no, oh, Jack. no one else. Jacko. No one else here had anything to do with it. We just yeah. were there because we were online at the time. But Jacko, if you'd like to say why or what happened, really, uh, I did not take part of anything. No, so okay. No, okay. This okay, is that's a good answer. Thank you. Um, yeah. Tamago, he made a video about me. Um, like an old video on me, and like that was it. And then one day, I remember Jacko like randomly bringing up his Snapchat in our group chat, saying, "Um, like trying to get into it." And like we didn't care. That was just like Jacko doing Jacko. And then one day, yeah, he like actually Jacko got into it. He he got That's into tomorrow's Snapchat, and then he's like, "I hacked the Snapchat." And then we joined his Discord server to like troll him, and then for some reason he he blamed it on me. He was like, <laughs> "I did it." When it was Jacko, the only reason me and Jake were there was like to troll. But yeah, we're those. we just that, bored. Yeah, Jacko was the one. Were that they even there? No, yeah, you were there. there. You were you were the person who supplied the pass. All that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I, I I really like that screenshot that he put of me on the video. I actually really like that. I have it saved. Yeah, so that's that's what actually. It's on my phone with, back uh, end. That's what actually happened with Tamago's uh, Snapchat. Yeah. It was Jacko, not me. It was one hundred percent Jacko. Easy. Freddy Feds are. You, I mean, you can't even deny it. Yeah, that was you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Jack was gonna resign that in a few minutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I'll also add on, Jack does not do any of that anymore. We're past that. No. And there's another question asked to me about the Val situation. So I don't know about that. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Well, Damn. Damn. I I mean, yeah, I mean, you can talk about that. I don't okay. know how much any of us know about it. Um, so the Val situation, that's like long and like complicated because people take things out of context and then they like spin it into like some false rumor and then that false rumor gets into like really big. So basically, um, me and Val, we were together, it was like as a joke at first, but she wanted it to be like a proper thing, so we, uh, we were together for like a couple of months, and then one of her friends DMs me one day, 
and he's like, Val has been playing us, like she said that she's with me, blah, 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 blah. And then I got mad at her and I, uh, we got into a big fight. It was, uh, probably, we could have handled it better, but it happened, the fight happened. Um, first I'm gonna say I didn't like uh, leak any they weren't nudes I'm just gonna say that they weren't nudes they were like uh, the, the pictures that she sent were the same that she sent to the other guy and like on her other social media and all I did was just post them in that Disco server that we were in, that we were, had a fight in, and then other people took a picture of that, and then that got leaked, and then people started saying that it was me. But uh, me and Val, we talked about was it last year, like uh, around this time last year, uh, we sorted it out. We're like friends again. She moved on, but like. We saw it, and I'm like, that's ended. But people take it out of context, and then they made up stuff. Like Val herself, she said that she wanted nothing to do with any of that. But like, you get those people that always want drama and all of that, starting something. Yeah. And then they just use those pictures, the same pictures. Like some of them aren't even real. But they just use them to say stuff, blah, blah, blah. Like... some issues at the moment the, the audio is gone I think oh really yeah 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 okay can people hear us now uh can hear us big. now big sorry about that guys yeah sorry we just had a little technical difficulties you know this is like the first time we're doing this but we'll probably get better the more times we do it so yeah Okay, is there question. another question? Uh, let's see, I'm checking now. Uh, this is a good one. How did the eagles meet? Oh. Okay. Um, I'll I'll start it because it's kind of like a long story. No, I'll start um, it. I'll start it, I'll start it, please. Can I? All right. right, you go for it, go for it. All right, so basically, we were like uh, two separate groups. Me and Adam were in another group, and Jacko and Jacob were in another group, but then our group split, and then we like, uh, Jacko and Jacob became friends with me and Adam, and then we formed like our own group, and that's like the short version of it. I've known Adam the longest since 2014, and Jacko and Jacob have known each other the longest since 
I don't know when. Um, they can it's been a couple of years. Them. Yeah, uh, me and Jacko met over Twitter like a couple of years ago, right? Right. And um, yeah, then we just got involved doing some different things together, and then eventually we need to find a programmer to work on a project with us and we found adam and then that's how we grouped up together right and then we came to yeah. cpo to, to help out because we had already done our kind of project but like we had accomplished what we were set out to do there so we yeah, came we here were, to help out we were friends with riley for over has it been over a year now it has been yeah, 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 so a bit over a year now, and then just recently, you know, we started helping out with CPO a bit. Me and Adam used to hate Jacko. That's the funny part. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I actually, a yeah. long time ago, me and Adam once had a little beef on Twitter for a little bit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> See, the thing is, we were quite young at the time, so, um, you know, when you're kind of, you're young and you're stupid, you don't really take into account it, and you just want to have fights, so, I mean, yeah. I guess in the end it worked out, but it's, it's, it's just funny. Yeah, it's friends now, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, it's just the history behind it is quite funny, and we like to laugh about yeah. it every now and then. Yeah. Yeah, it was pretty funny, but Adam's still a skit, though. Yeah, that's, that, <laughs> that is a true fact. Crazy. And he is indeed slow in the code, I can con- <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, let me see the other question. Um, what do you- What do you guys see, uh, what do you guys think CPO's future will be? Um, all right, well, I'm not a developer, so I don't know like, how long it would take. Hopefully, we'll like, stay last, well, I'll live Flash at least, right? Mm. Yeah. Um, I don't know, just hopefully like more growth getting more users on uh maybe five million would be kind of cool <laughs> yeah you think riley um the boss <laughs> i hope that cpo lives past uh 2020 because the other day, well, I'm gonna be honest, I actually wanted CPO to die with Flash, like, a year ago. I didn't think CPO would have a HTML5 version, or, like, work on it. I thought we'll just, like, end in 2020. But, after seeing everything, I'm like... CPO just can't die like that, so we should like try to make it live. It would be a big shame if it died, considering how far it's gotten. Like true, yeah. how, you know, all the bumpy parts and everything. It, it all came it came out on top all the time. So it would be be a shame to let it die in twenty twenty. But I don't think I don't think it will. Do you have another question? Um, yeah. What movies do you guys all recommend to watch? Um, to be honest, I don't really watch movies. Um, I, I'm not a movie guy. I, I, I go to the cinema like twice a year, maybe. That, that would like the only time I watch movies. TV shows. I feel like TV shows are way I don't even watch TV. I just, I just watch YouTube. Really, that's what I do. What about you, Riley? What do you do? What do you watch? Uh, I watch movies. I like sneak into the cinema. You know that? Nope. Uh, 
What? No, I don't. Wait, wait. What? Say that again. Which one? I, I sneak into like cinemas. Remember? Oh, Especially. oh! I thought you were saying a a, a movie name. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, Why are you sneaking into cinemas? <laughs> because uh, I'm a I'm a rabbi. <laughs> <laughs> I I understand. <laughs> um, but uh, I would recommend seeing Joker. That's a good movie. Uh, yeah, that's it. Joker. To be that Joker movie, that's the one movie that I've kind of been tempted to go see. No, you should see it. In fairness, now, you know, one movie I watched recently, which was really good, was um, It Part 2. Like, obviously, uh, I had watched the part one. But to be honest, that whole thing was really well made. What, you think it was good? Yeah, you don't like it? You didn't like it? Well, I thought it was alright, but, like, nothing special. Nah, I, I, I liked it. I liked how they tied it in with the first movie as well. Well, if you like It Chapter 2, then you'll definitely like uh, Joker. Joker's really yeah, good. I'd say. I just, <laughs> I don't know. There'd probably be a few characters sitting beside me in the cinema if, if you get my drift. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna do like a mod meet up now. Um, slashy, I'll be asking questions on VC. Alright. So can start. Hold on, I'll make an announcement now. Okay, is everyone ready? I'm going to be starting now. Wait, where are you? Are you doing something? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. Yeah, I'm talking about the people in game. Uh, Alright. Uh, first question. What color is rock hopper? Color is rock hopper. Hmm, I I don't know. Yeah, I really don't know. I think it might be. Green. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, everyone seems to be saying red, but I'm not too sure. Ah, uh, that one person that said blue. Yes, maybe maybe you're right. Uh... Okay, next question. Name one e-god. Uh, 
I, I like how um, Jacko and Jacob barely got any shout-outs here. It's funny. First person to say Harley wins. What's two plus What's the capital of Germany? Okay, I'm going to do a bonus round right now, and the winner will get 50,000 coins. So, are you guys ready? What's well, one plus one?
All right, so uh, yeah, that's the end of that. Uh, you know, this is the first time we're doing this, so it's a little choppy, but eventually, uh, hopefully it will be a lot more uh, entertaining the next time we do this. I'll get some different topics going, maybe some non-CP topics, but I think it was pretty decent for, you know, the first try. Uh, thanks for coming in, everyone. This is the end of our first podcast. Thank you to everyone for attending. The keep in mind this is like the first time we've tried something like this, but we we plan on doing another one, but like more planned, more better, more entertaining. And uh, thank you once again for coming. Waddle on. Thank you, Jacko, for that. No problem.